five scary videos. Knock, knock. YouTube uploader Tim Morozov is a fearless Russian ghost hunter and explores some of the most haunted houses in Russia. In this particular video, Tim decides to visit a haunted house where the owners were tortured by something incredibly evil. Tim explains that the owners of this house each suffered the same terrifying nightmares at exactly the same time. In the nightmare, the entire family gathered in a circle, holding hands, and in the middle was a black horned goat. They started singing a song, which was more like a ritual or a chant. The goat then began to turn into a horrifying, screaming monster. Terrified, they all woke up, all together, at the same time. The story didn't end there though. The man of the family started recording what happened when the family had this strange dream and it left him scared out of his mind. The family were all singing the song out loud whilst they were asleep and the sound of a goat could be heard as well as demonic voices that weren't that of his family. Not only did the family have the most horrible nightmares, they also experienced poltergeist activity and a ghostly presence that was there all the time in the house. What's even more disturbing is that the young daughters of the family loved to play a knocking game to each other and one day one of the daughters knocked first and then another knock was heard but her sister wasn't at home. Instead, it came from whatever sinister presence haunts the family's home. Tim decides to set up his equipment and spend the night in the family's haunted home. Друзья, я не знаю, как это объяснить, но возможно это все из-за рассказов соседей, может быть самовнушение, но в этом доме реально чувствуется чье-то присутствие, как будто бы я тут не один. Не знаю, как это объяснить, но какое-то чувство такое есть прям.
Тут есть кто-нибудь? A couple of Tim's devices trigger, and then he hears loud footsteps from the attic. Startled by this, Tim takes a look, but no one's there. Tim then realizes there is some paranormal activity in the house, so he decides to feed it with an electromagnetic pulse emitter to get a better response from whatever is there. After some time, Tim hears a loud bang and decides to check it out. Там есть кто-нибудь? Ты можешь поговорить со мной стуками? Один стук да, два стука нет. Ты готов ответить на мои вопросы? Tim then picks up some weird sounds on his recording device and chooses to investigate. What he finds is horrifying. Шепот. Я явно слышу шепот. Не понимаю, откуда. Там есть кто-нибудь? Зло батарейки закончились. Что это?
Кто тут? Я кажется, понял. Оно сильно в темноте. Не боится света. Можно вырубить свечи. Твою мать. Tim becomes so scared that he cuts the investigation short and waits with a loaded shotgun until dawn. He then gets out of there but vows to return to the house in the future. Number 4. Till death do us part. Chinese YouTube channel Outdoor Zhao Long investigate an old haunted building. The video starts out with the duo in what appears to be an old bedroom covered in thick dust. They hear a strange noise coming from a closed closet and decide to take a look inside. Yeah. Inside the closet is a creepy looking monkey doll, but nothing else. The pair then leave the room with the closet door left open and things get weird from here. Come here, Upon opening the closet door, the pair discover the monkey doll has moved to the other side of the closet, all on its own. Now I must mention, one of the pair, Lao Dai, has a strong hatred with dolls, and it all started from this. 
你妈！操、哦！操你个妈的！俩人搞一起，我操你妈的！他他肯定动了！操你妈的！我操你妈！干啥去啊？你干啥去啊？They grab the doll, rush outside, and throw it into the thick brush. Then decide to venture back inside the abandoned building, where it gets even weirder. 对，咱俩要文明直播。哎！我操你妈的！我去你妈的！哎呦我操！我操你妈！哎，你踢没呀？我去你妈的！我都踢飞去了，踢哪去了？我被小轩在里边了！我操你妈呀！这猴还回来了，猴子。The doll appears back in the closet, even though the pair had tossed it out into the bushes outside. They both agree to venture outside to try and find the doll, but realizing their search would be impossible in the thick brush, they decide to head back in and reinspect the closet. 我操你妈！哎，废物！我操你妈！我来，给我出来！操你个妈的！快出来！别跑！给我堵住！堵着！哎。我踢来，这我踢，我去你妈的！你看我这操你妈的！你妈了个逼的，没头没脑的了。They throw the doll outside again, this time making sure it's long gone, never to be seen again, or so they think. 你跟我你说老戴那废着，你知道不？还得我的脚，估计是真踢远了。我操你妈的！出来，谁呀？出来，这边。小心点，小心点！这会儿东西绝对有东西，你小心点！出来！别跑！是这屋不？操你妈！正是这里。谁呀？疯狂的啊！ Freaked out by the fact the doll had mysteriously returned to the building, they decide to tie a leash on the haunted monkey doll so it cannot move around on its own again. Or can it? Oh my! I'm gonna have a holiday. 操你妈！我这抓，我抓死你！这里头有有牌位，这里都有排位，那上面都是排位，那那那那上面上面上面！操你妈的！妈的逼！窗户罩上。嗯。嗯。我操你妈你！哎！你猴子呢？啊！说你妈猴子没了？啊！猴子呢？哎哎啊！
我操你妈你！哎，你猴子呢？啊？你说猴子没了？那、啊、猴子。Number three, the witch in the woods. The guys over at Mind CTV investigate a haunted witch's house in the middle of the Black Forest, which was once abandoned over 40 years ago. And what follows is something straight out of the Blair Witch movie. So we were told about a location that was in the middle of the woods uh, where this witch used to stay at, and apparently. People still believe that there's some kind of haunting associated with the cabins, so we went out at night and started searching. None of us had any idea of what this night was going to turn into. We couldn't have been prepared for what we ended up seeing. Apparently, kids used to go missing in the town like 40, what did you say, 40, 50 years ago? So, yeah, they all assumed that this witch or this woman was kidnapping kids from town. Oh, fuck. Hey, right there. Oh, way over there. Crazy. Is it on the other one? There's a bunch of them out here. Looks like three. Searching in the dark, creepy forest for some time, the guys eventually stumble across not one, but three witches' houses. I'm gonna look in this other window. Oh, look, there's a door in there. Ooh, it's got bomb bags. Okay, this one's kind of awesome too. Yo, what the fuck is that? And as I got closer, I realized that it was a dead animal. Okay. Is that a rabbit? I'm sorry, don't get Oh, bro. You see this? What? But then I saw what looked like almost a, I don't know, a spike, like a hand carved spike, but it had twine as a handle. It's like a fucking shank. Where? Where? Oh my god. The Mind CTV team come across a dead animal carcass in the grass and what appears to be some sort of homemade dagger outside one of the houses. Spooked by the findings, they think it would be a good idea to venture inside. You see right behind you? Oh, uh, okay. There's like a bunch of steaks and twine and shit over here. <clears throat> Do you see that shit? Yeah, yeah I saw it. Hello. Oh, dude. What do you got up there? Shit. Weird shit. Like what? Like, hanging shit? What kind of hanging shit? Here, I don't know if we should go up here, honestly. What? A bunch of just weird stuff hanging from the ceiling. There was like trinkets made out of sticks. Obviously, it looked like some form of witchcraft. There's like a bunch of shit hanging from the ceiling in those jars. Casey goes up into the attic and comes across trinkets used in witchcraft hanging from the ceiling. 
and jars of what appears to be remains of foul smelling liquid are all over the attic. The team then decide to sell the spirit box in the attic and what happens is truly the stuff of nightmares. Take a look. There was a really audible, almost like a scream or something, and it was coming from outside of the cabin. What was that? That was loud. That from was over outside, here, right? right? Hang on. Shh, shh. Yeah. Number two, in the window. BJ and Michael from the Korean YouTube channel, DDoc Michael, upload bone chilling footage of creepy haunted places in Korea. In this particular video, Michael visits an abandoned complex. The place is known to be haunted by evil spirits, but Michael just isn't phased by that and decides to explore alone. The chair seems to move all on its own, and then a cushion is dragged behind the bench, but it gets worse. Take a look. Wow, Strange breathing sounds, followed by a loud knocking, can be heard as Michael ventures through the lobby area and stairwell. As he ventures up to a second floor room, an object is mysteriously pulled across the floor. Utterly terrified and struggling to come to terms with what he has just witnessed, Michael continues his exploration only to spot something terrifying. Take a look.
어? 아니야. 뭐야? 아이씨. A large figure can be seen moving across an upper level window, and Michael gives chase. He enters a room where strange noises are heard, and then a coat or a jacket type of clothing appears in the door window. Michael charges towards the door to confront whatever is inside, climbs through the door window, but it's locked from the inside. Michael then decides he's had enough and just gets the hell out of there. Number one, can't see me. In this clip, fearless Russian YouTuber, Dark Ghost Paranormal, ventures out to an abandoned haunted cemetery somewhere in the forests of Russia. When he arrives, he begins by recording himself walking around the cemetery, mentioning that he doesn't feel safe at all, and that every sound he hears is making him feel increasingly on edge. While walking around, he stumbles across suspicious footprints in the thick muddy leaves, but who or what would be walking around this old desolate cemetery in the middle of a creepy forest? He decides to set up cameras all around the haunted cemetery and captures something oddly disturbing. Listen carefully. Someone or something can be heard running in the darkness. Then a white ghostly apparition is picked up on one of his cameras. Nightfall begins to set in and Dark Ghost decides to conduct an EVP session in the middle of the graveyard to try and contact any spirits that might be present. A voice tells him horrifyingly that he came in vain, that they know he's here, and that they are watching him. When he asks, who are they? The voice replies with, the guards, and that they are everywhere around him in the graveyard, and that they will take him. Shocked by what he heard on the EVP, Dark Ghost decides to cut the EVP session short and wait until complete darkness to carry on with his investigation. What follows will most definitely terrify you. Так, друзья, сейчас я хочу просунуть камеру. Честно, мне страшно туда руку засовывать. Но все же попробую сейчас. Strange scratching sounds can be heard coming from inside the cabin, as if someone or something is dragging its claws or nails along the wooden door. Dark Ghost sticks his camera through the small crack in the door to take a closer look, but no one's inside. What happens next is truly frightening.
His camera picks up a dark, shadowy figure lurking in the trees close by, and then while Dark Ghost is exploring the abandoned graveyard, something he can't see charges towards him, knocking him to the ground. Shaken and terrified, Dark Ghost rushes to the cabin to grab his items, but hears the same eerie scratches coming from inside the cabin walls. Then the sound of something dead can be heard. Dark Ghost mentions he's really scared now and points the camera towards a dark path where he senses something approaching him in the darkness. The zombie-like noise can be heard again from behind him. He spins the camera around and a white mist can be seen floating away. Then something can be heard stalking him in the darkness. And with that, Dark Ghost decides to call it a day or night from there. Thanks for watching and if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. It'll really help me out. And if you want to watch the full videos of any of these clips, I'll leave the links to them down in the description. See you in the next video.